reading, it's called The Last Innocent Man by Philip Mongolan. Do you want the story? Mm -hmm. It's the story about a lawyer, a defense lawyer, who is excellent at his job and seems to manage by hook or crook to get people off. And he is doing very well financially, and all of a sudden it gets to him that this is not right. He's allowing crooks back into the community, and he's not sure what they're doing. So uh, his conscience bothers him. And it bothers him so much that he is sleepless by night and makes him feel quite unsteady about the whole thing. He's very nervous until he decides he's got to stop this. He can't defend them anymore. And then there's that sudden unusual end to the story. It's, it's wonderful hearing how his conscience bothers him and how he goes through all the different ideas of how he should behave. And then at the end there's an unusual ending. I'm not going to tell you the ending. <laughs> No, you don't want to give it away. <laughs> Jean, I'm so glad you enjoyed the story. Oh, I love this story. Mm -hmm. Yes. Thank you, Jean. Oh, you're welcome. welcome. So it's interesting how the story ends, right? Yes. And the sudden end of the story. And then he, he decides to stop this because he can't defend it anymore. Essentially, he's, he's concerned that they're going to go back to the community yes. and continue. It, it worries him. It worries him. The thought of them going back into the community. Yes.